says, why would I want to go where fans only support you from the third inning through the sixth? That quote is obviously something that pissed off a lot of Padres fans, as you might imagine, right? Like, okay, why are you bringing your anger at the Padres organization out on us? We're good fans. We show up. We don't show up at the third inning and leave in the sixth. Are you kidding? That's not who we are. That's more like Dodger fans. You didn't have to say that. So, yeah, Padres fans are like, oh, so now you want to sign with the Padres? Now you want to be with the Padres? That's interesting. You didn't want any part of us, and you were criticizing the fans, but now you want to be a part of us? I understand why Padres fans are upset with that, and I, I don't like that comment from Cole Hamels. That did not need to happen. If you grew up a Padres fan, you don't make that comment about Padres fans, right? Joe Musgrove would never make that comment about Padres fans, right? That did not need to be said, but he is correct about where the Padres were at that time, right? Not about the fans, but where the team was at that time. They didn't bring back Adrian Gonzalez, right? They weren't going to pay for Adrian Gonzalez. They didn't bring back their big free agents. They didn't go spend a bunch of money on big free agents back then. That just didn't happen. And ownership was not the same as it was now, right? Peter Seidler is way different than what he, he acts way different than what ownership acted like back then, right? And A.J. Preller is different than the people who ran the baseball operations back then, right? It's different. So now he's probably like, well, uh, the ownership, they are dedicated. They want to spend money. They're bringing in a lot of talent. I want to be a part of that now. I could see why fans would be frustrated about that, right? Like, okay, now you want to be, that's total bandwagon. Now you want to be a part of us? No, 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 no. I don't want that. So I understand fans being mad about that. Like, again, I don't, I don't like Hamels' comments about what he, uh, about the fans. He did not need to do that, right? The fans don't deserve that. The fans can't control how much money the ownership spends. They can't control that. Right? They couldn't control that the Padres didn't want to bring back Adrian Gonzalez. Right? They couldn't control that. So don't bring it out on the fans. You can criticize ownership, but don't do it to the fans. Don't do it about the fans. That's not fair to us. Right? I totally understand that viewpoint. Um, so, yeah, again, I'm not the biggest fan of Cole Hamels. But as I said yesterday, I'm a fan of the signing. It's a minor league deal. If he can help the Padres win, that's great. If he doesn't, okay, whatever. It's a minor league deal. Who cares, right? Um, I'm fine with the deal itself, the deal. And he was right. He was probably frustrated as a Padres fan growing up. Uh, his team not spending money and not didn't seem like they cared as much about winning as they do, let's say, uh, now, right? Um, so I, I totally understand where he was coming from with that. And by the way, in this Union Tribune article, after he made those comments, why would I want to go where fans only support you from the third inning through the sixth? Uh, he had a message from his parents. And his parents are like, or this is from Hamels, says, quote, my parents called me and said, what are you talking about? And Hamels says, I told them exactly what we talked about at the dinner table when I was in high school. So pretty much about why wouldn't why why won't our ownership spend money? Why why aren't we hanging with other teams? Why can't we bring in free agents? Like it's it's frustrating. This sucks. That's probably how he was talking to his parents at the dinner table, right? Like we're putting in effort. We're Padres fans. Like let's give some effort back. Ownership, Padres, the organization. Um, but yeah, his family was like, "What? What are you talking about? We have a great fan base." We're a passionate fan base. Why, why are you saying that? He's saying this. his comments were more about the ownership, the organization, alienating the fan base. Uh, but he did still, that's still attacking the fans. Like, you can't take that back. I'm sure he will, when he speaks to the media, he will apologize for that again um, because he's with the Padres now. Um, but... I'm welcoming I'm welcoming him in to the organization. I hope he does well because I all I care about is the Padres winning. 
Um, it's not like he's a horrible human being. This isn't signing Trevor Bauer or bringing Clevenger in, right? I'd be pissed off about that. Hamels, it seems like he's a good human being, uh, but he did rub fans the wrong way with those comments. 